What's up guys? Adopt Me has got the new update for the mountain house. It's time to build giant mountain house for builds, over 60 new castle parts, and the new premium pet, the frost unicorn. Let's go check all this amazing stuff out. Oh me, oh my, Nikiko, it's raining today as well for the new update. I also like the rain. I do like the rain. It was really cool that the rain update came out and had a whole bunch of cool stuff with it, but it is time to check out the new house. There it is, the new mountain house. Cost $3,000 a game, pretty pricey, but let's do this. All right, so there's the mountain house. Let's choose the color, let's do purple. Yes, and there it is, the brand new mountain house. Oh, wow. I love the look of it from the outside. It looks so pretty. Let's go inside and check this bad boy out. Oh, wow. Am I in a fairy tale? <clears throat> I feel like I'm in like some RPG, like a cool fairy tale or something. So much room over here. I could, just make, I could literally just make a house here. I need nothing else. So this room right here, just put a dome here and everything's a-okay. Oh, it's so creepy and dark over here. Can I have like some skeletons to add and fight? <laughs> Can I turn this into my very own RPG? This is gigantic. Look at the pretty water. It's crazy. So there's two automatic lifts. It lifts you up and down. One from the bottom of the lake, and one from the top up here. I guess this would obviously be the go-to spot to build your castle. Wow, so a lot of arches, round triangle, corners. Wow, when they said 60 stuff, they meant 60 stuff. Holy moly. Trees, castle foundation, castle round tower giant castle square oh my oh my oh my castle walls that's crazy but as of right now this is kind of just a first look at the actual map itself i don't have much uh, intentions to build a giant castle to be honest that stuff would be pretty pricey in my opinion to build a giant castle but overall this is a ginormous area and for you builders out there that's looking to build a castle this is the one well, for anyone wondering, you can definitely go to the top of the mountain in the new build, which is, uh, in my opinion, a bit extreme. But it's a huge little area. The sand and water kind of cuts off. But if you look at the very peak, you can see the Adopt Me Island over there. Eesh. What a view, though. So honestly, the house seems really cool. I especially like it from the outside, although it's a bit skinny like a portal. I kind of wish it was a bit fatter, but that house is massive. And it has a lot of spiky hills, and I think it's actually, on my opinion, it's a bit too much of all the spiky hills and all the hidden corners and how the the actual sand and water doesn't go around correctly. Mm, I don't know about that, to be honest. Well, he's a bit crowded right now. <laughs> but here is the Frost Unicorn Pet for a thousand Roblox, which I gotta say is really, 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 really pricey for this unicorn. Hopefully I can trade something for him, but he is extremely pricey. Even the face is a bit different. He has some snow in his tail, his feet as well. And I'd reckon, I reckon they're not the most reskinned ever, but it's pretty close. I do like the frost unicorn. He does look cool, but that price is way out of the league of what it should be. So let's actually take a look really quick what his neon color is. I'm guessing blue, it just makes sense. And it's actually purple? Purple and blue. Purple actually sounds really, really cool to be honest. Like I said, I don't think I'm actually gonna make one of these. It would be cool if I did. I just don't think I'll be able to get that many. I mean, it cost $40 to buy that many, but the purple actually looks pretty. I do like it a lot. I was thinking it was gonna be blue, because it's blue, but I'm glad they actually switched it up and made it purple, but I guess it's not a full reskin of the unicorn. It's a little bit different shape, but honestly, overall, he's pretty cool. I just don't think he's $10 cool. <laughs> Why, hello there. You made it to the end of the show. I want to say thank you for watching that video all the way through. If you want to support us more, we have this thanks button now on most all the videos. You can throw us a couple dollars, kind of like a tip that says you like the video. We appreciate all the help we can get. It's been really tough here on YouTube lately, so anything would help. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you guys for flying with us, and we'll talk to you guys later. Dusk and fly. Like, subscribe. Peace.